Hello, my name is I King Skies, and today we are going to be reacting to what just happened <laughs> on SmackDown Live. Now, this show was beautiful. I mean, <laughs> it was beautiful. Most of it was beautiful. This whole thing throughout SmackDown was beautiful, but I wanted to focus on something that just happened, main event. Jay Uso is the number one contender for the WWE Championship. And WWE, if you were going to give him this push, why did it have to come to the expense of Roman Reigns? Is that the only reason why you gave him the push? Is because he's his cousin of Roman Reigns? Anyway, Jay Uso. Jay Uso was finally getting a push. I like it either way. I don't like it how he got it, though. But I like how Roman Reigns did it, like... I did not like how WWE, because he wasn't going to get, if Roman Reigns didn't come back, he wasn't going to get it. Let's be honest. He was not going to get this push. If Roman Reigns did not come back, Jey Uso would not be the number one contender right now. But he did. So WWE booked him against Jey Uso. But I like how in the WWE storyline that he forced that, that he forced him in the match. I like that because Roman Reigns is supposed to be, if you want him to be a badass so bad, he's supposed to do that type of stuff. But Jey Uso is the WWE, um, WWE champion, I wish. Jey Uso is uh, the number one contender. Is he winning the championship? Hell no. But it has potential to be a good match. And if it's, it's going to be, Paul Heyman is in it, so it has to be a good uh, build up. But uh, SmackDown was beautiful tonight. Jay Uso being the number one contender. Let me see what you guys um, think down in the comments below. Like this video. My name is I King Skies, and thanks for watching.